I wanted to talk about a situation that comes from time to time about numbering of fingers. And this was sort of an interesting case. So the patient says to the technologist, this is the patient's stated history, that they have left third finger trigger finger, and that's why they're getting the x-rays. And then this is the physician order uh, history, which says trigger finger left ring finger. So there's third finger and ring finger, and then the technologist marks with the, with the number three over this finger. Well, there's some confusion between if this is if this is the third finger, then the patient thinks there's a problem here, and the doctor thinks there's a problem here. And so uh, the question is, well, is is that true? Is there a discrepancy? Or is this really a matter of misnumbering of, of the digit involved? And so I want to talk about that very briefly. So the reason that the doctor refers to a ring finger and doesn't give a number is a lot of hand and wrist surgeons do that. And I think it's a good habit to get into because really there are only four fingers, right? One, two, three, four. And this is a thumb. We don't call this a finger usually. Now some people might call these all digits. So you could say the third digit is this digit, but the third finger might mean this finger. So um, I think that that you have the option of either saying number of the digit or naming the finger. So naming the digit. So thumb, index or pointer finger, long finger, ring finger, small finger, and using those names reduces this ambiguity about which finger we're talking about, which digit we're talking about. Another thing, just to make sure that the patient is communicating, maybe the patient did say the third finger, but they meant this finger, the ring finger, is to have them point to which finger is bothering them, and then you name it the appropriate name, or you mark it. You say, you know, this, this in fact, is this the symptomatic finger, because we're kind of relying on the history that's being communicated to the technologist as to which which area is really abnormal, and you can understand where the ambiguity comes from. So something to be aware of, and um, I would use the naming convention. Uh, otherwise, you could use the digit convention, you know, calling these all digits in one, two, three, four, five. But I think the numbering, or the, the words thumb, index, long, ring, small is clearer.